What's up guys, we're back again for another Marvel Puzzle Quest video. Um, so, I tweeted I tweeted about this, my, this specific Miles Morales. Obviously it's not even a big thing that I tweeted about it. Like, I was just wanting him in the game. Um, he's in the game now. <laughs> he seems like a basic, every everyday five star. Um, meaning, he, he counters somebody. He's not game breaking. He's not a he's not a meta unit. You can use him with uh, Spider Verse characters. Thank God, um, you know. So like this one right here, Miles Morales uh, Spider Fit. They could have added like green or some some other neon colors as well. But this is pretty cool. I, I would have thought that they would have given um, us regular Miles Morales for a three star in a different outfit. Um, and then maybe give us hint, this as a skin, but like, I like it. It's pretty cool. So we're going to be going over the five star Miles Morales. Um, I already went over him a little bit. I like skimmed through his abilities. Uh, but I, I like, I like how basic this character is. So basically his red, so, um, convert it to four charge tiles to basic tiles. Then deal 443 damage to the target for every two. So we got single target damage and AOE damage, removing charge tiles from the board. This ability basically countering Jane Foster. Um, you're not destroying them or matching them away. You are converting them. So she can't do anything with her abilities when you do this. Um, for every two charge tiles converted, increases damage by 10%. So it's a damage increase ability as well. Stun Miles and the target for one turn. So he got his four star Miles Morales ability. You, instead of stunning the single, the, the, the front target for one turn, you stun yourself and the front target um, and deal 800 and 842 damage to the enemy team. So AOE damage, single target, stun, uh, charge style conversion. So let's go to straight level four. Convert eight, level five has, you only convert up to eight. So this is a hard counter to Jane. Um, and you're matching red, so she can't really single target nuke you, you know? Um, so level four, convert to eight charge tiles, then deal 1,107 damage. For every four charge tiles destroyed, increase this damage by 25%. So maybe, like, destroyed? Like, you're converting them, right? So that's not counting, like, that's not, that doesn't count towards destroying. So maybe, I guess, he works, he feeds off of charge tiles as well. Maybe pair him with Jane. She can use blue and yellow, but I mean, 535 still best build for Jane Foster, right? So why, like, is this better than Jane Foster's red? Who knows? Uh, the playtesting has yet to be done. Um, let's see. Increase this damage by 25%. Deal 1,448 damage to the enemy. So AOE. Um, 450. Uh, level 450. 4,451. Single target damage. AOE is 5,819 damage. 550. Not too far behind. <coughs> so yeah. Pretty basic. And then level 5. Um... Let's see, you you can't go above converting eight charge tiles. And then, uh, so you deal single target damage would be 5,342. Increase this damage by 30%. So let's see, for every four charge tiles destroyed, you increase this damage by 25%. And level five, you increase it by 30. So 5% more for every four charge tiles. So eight charge tiles equals 60% damage increase for single target, increases damage by 30%. So deal 2,104 damage to the enemy team. All right, so 5, 000, at level five is 5,342 single target damage. AOE is 8,457. Um, 550 not so far off damage wise. Um, 11,000 single target, 18,000. There's a lot of characters that deal way more damage than this. Like, hence Hulkbuster, 4-star. So maybe this is straight up just a cap. This is, I guess, a, the damage is good. Single target and AoE. It's basic. It's it's uh, kind of low. It's kind of on the low end. 
for being a new five star in you know 10 years in but this is more of a counter ability to jane foster because she's very it, it's annoying let's just face it it's annoying when you go up against jane chasm jane or not jane chasm excuse me jane um shang chi and J, uh, jane foster and you know iron heart right it, it's annoying so this is basically a hard counter the damage it's okay uh, it increases, obviously, so don't get me wrong. I know that it increases. You guys are going to be like, he doesn't know that it increases. That's why he's saying it's average or below average. Like, I know, but what I'm saying is you're not really focused on destroying charge tiles because you're going to convert them to normal tiles. It's just not the same thing. All right, so these two abilities right here. So this one is the one where it gets me. Web Warfare, four purple AP at level four. Uh, wait, let's go over the ability first. I'm, I'm jumping way ahead. Convert one basic tile to web tiles. That's an active for four. Uh, passive. Whenever your team matches a web or attack tile, create one charge tile. Whenever your team matches a web or attack tile, create one charge tile or tiles, right? Web and attack tile match matches deal six percent damage if you're able to pair and i really i really because carnage and Noel are the same character right and miles morales is miles morales uh four star carnage is cletus cassidy two different ones i don't even know if that did i say his name right yeah i think i did um if you're able to pair this five star carnage with four star carnage the match damage can potentially get crazy, right? Whenever you, whenever your team matches a web or attack tile. So right off the bat, I don't know if you're able to pair these two together, four star carnage and this carnage. Um, but if you are the, the one PVP simulator team or just team in general, right? For two day PVP, PVP simulator, PVE, whatever. The one team that I'm going towards is miles morales carnage four star carnage for the attack tiles and obviously um miguel o'hara spider-man 2099 carnage or not carnage uh spider-man 2099 i'm over here thinking too many carnages he's not even a carnage so anyways those three characters miguel o'hara spider-man 2099 miles morales carnage and four star carnage um right web tile easy you know free free web and attack tile creation max damage increase it doesn't have a cap it's probably going to have a cap because that could be broken um if you don't use four star carnage you can basically use uh, you know there's a lot of other characters and then uh so let's go over it it's not available in a so level four when uh level three convert two basic tiles to web tiles web and attack uh, tile matches deal 20 percent damage matches okay so matches deal damage they, they deal the extra damage it doesn't increase your match damage it just deals damage right or increases damage either or um level four web uh, web and attack tile matches deal 30 percent damage um level five convert three so you're gonna have web warfare at level five specifically because it creates three instead of two <laughs> i wish it was at least four but i'll take the three i'll take the three convert three basic tiles to web tiles web and attack tile matches deal 55 percent damage so yeah if you're able to pair them with four star carnage there you go it's not going to be meta but it could be crazy um, and Miguel O'Hara. I said Miguel O'Hara, uh, Spider-Man 2099 Carnage. Oh, that's funny. All right, so last but not least, this is going to be a short one, too. It's not, you know, what, nine minutes in? Not bad. Six armed assault. Six. I wish they would add Doppelganger Spider-Man from the Spider-Man animated series from the original Fox TV, like Fox Cartoon, uh, Fox Network, whatever it's called. That's the, from that one episode. You guys, real Marvel fans know who I'm talking about. All right, so six armed assault, six green AP. Create six strength, 188 attack tiles, and half as many enemy attack tiles of the same strength. Then if there are more than three web tiles, 
and power the friendly created attack tiles by 25%. Then convert up to... Where is it at? Then convert up to two web tiles to charge tiles. So he just feeds himself. Um, yet again, I, I really hope you're able to pair, pair four star carnage with him. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know the actual comic book story to to this uh, Miles Morales. But uh, please, just please let us pair him with four star carnage so things can just get crazy. Um, passive at the start of Miles' turn, if there are less than three charge tiles on the board. Create one tile. At the start of milestone, if there are less than three charge tiles on the board, create one. So you're basically creating charge tiles. You want to convert as much as you can. Use him to counter Jane or any charge style creating character. Uh, five, four, four, uh, best build. Because from level four to, f actually no, because the four creates the web tiles. You need, so four, five, four would be the best build for him or five five three right green being three assuming you can use four star carnage um that's gonna be my only letdown obviously there's a lot of other team uh, characters to use but uh create six strength tiles so you're basically creating your own attack tiles um let's see attack tiles are the same strength then if there are more than three web tiles miguel o'hara's you're gonna it's that's gonna be your go-to. I would say Chasm, but no. Um, I just don't even use Chasm anymore. It's just, it's tragic. They literally annihilated him by the nerf, by the double nerf. They ruined Gwenum by not letting her deal any match damage and, you know, not letting her actually tank, but it is what it is. I get why they did that with Gwenum because of, you know, Miles, four star Miles and, you know, SM2099. But uh, let's see, at the start of the turn, charge, okay, so 450, strength 7, 5, 7, tiles, 550, 16, 36, that's crazy. So level 3, create uh, attack tiles, convert up to 3 web tiles to charge tiles. So maybe they're just going another route. This is crazy. You can use him to counter Jane. You can use him with Jane. There's just a lot of teams that you can use this character with. They may, I don't think they're going with the normal web tile route, but since it's a Miles Morales character, they're like, okay, let's give him web tiles so people won't be upset. And you can actually use him with, you know, Spider-Verse characters. But you can also use him with Jane to counter Jane. Like, well, that's crazy. Um, it's, like, you, you can actually... There's, just, there's a lot of characters to use with this this uh, Miles Morales. He's pretty versatile. Um, hence why I said his damage is not there. Uh, it, it might be. Playtesting is what we have to do before I actually start to judge this character. But on paper, he looks nice. Looks fun. Versatile. I'm loving the web warfare. Maybe you can use this to, to help uh, Gwenum uh, insta-kill with her red AoE. Um, I'm, I'm thinking... Uh, four five four best build for now i wouldn't want to put his web warfare at three because at five is the only you know five converts three uh, basic tiles to web tiles so four five four all right feature uh, feeder updates so spider-man classic that's a three star to spider-man infinity warfare spider-man black suit uh, miles morales spider fit miles morales spider-man um, and Miles Morales Carnage Symbiote. I w my Miles Morales, uh, Miles Morales Spider-Man, like four star, he's almost, he's like 340 something. So I'll be getting quite a bit of covers. I think like three. And then uh, Miles Morales three star goes to Carnage Cletus Cassidy. I was right. Oh my God, this is gonna be insane. Um, oh wait, oh no. So you, this right here, I mean, I'm just going to say it confirms that we're not going to be able to use uh, four-star Carnage with five-star Miles Carnage. I mean, they're two different characters this is right here, they're but they're both Carnages. And then four-star Miles goes to Kingpin, Spider-Verse, and then um, Carnage, Cletus Cassidy goes to Prophet of Null. I wish you could just use all the characters together. Like, that'd be pretty cool. But other than that, I like the character. I, like, 
if the three star is anything like him, which he's probably not, I mean, I wouldn't see why he would be. Uh, usually they always make him exactly like the five star, but a little bit less powerful. And then another thing that I got to throw out there, I didn't, I looked over the Q&A with the devs and all that. Like, why aren't they focusing on doing a mass update, maybe three characters a week for health wise and ability wise on every single three star that needs it. And, you know, the new, the new three stars are power creeping. Um, the new three stars are even power creeping some of the four stars in the game. And that's saying a lot for the old three stars. Like, they need a really massive update on the three stars or they're going to get left behind and people are only going to start, like, they're only going to rely on the new ones. But other than that, I don't want to take up your guys' time. As always, let me know what you guys think and I'll catch you guys in the next one.